Hi, I'm uh, actually in Chillicothe, Illinois. Uh, again, if you get a chance to come to Chillicothe, you may want to go, I don't know, someplace cool. It's nice, small, western, midwestern town, and uh, uh, glad I'm here, but uh, looking forward to leaving, I guess. In the middle of a self-actualization, my favorite class, uh, and I want to just, one of the things I was looking at is I uh, want to try to convey to you the essence of my work. Uh, basically, uh, 25, 24, 23, some years ago like that, what I looked at and discovered was that there are two different worlds. Uh, that okay, Before that, I am a kinesiologist, chiropractor kinesiologist, and we looked at the body and we look at the body as a biological computer that can answer yes or no, strong or weak. That's the whole premise of kinesiology. That's how you get answers. It's like any other computer. It's the binary system and that's how it works. And when, because I've looked at the body as a biological computer, what I've started to look at is the operating systems upon which we run on. Right? And the operating systems, there are, looks like two variables. One system we come running on. We come in uh, in bliss, inspiration, unconditional love. We're excited about everything. Uh, we trust implicitly, and everything is fun. I'm talking about when you came onto the planet as a kid, a spiritual being on this physical journey. And then we start to learn a completely other operating system, which I call the antiquated operating system, which is based on fear, tiredness, resentment. But that system we have to learn. We have to use a tremendous amount of our intelligence to learn. And it leads us to live, living a less than a mediocre life, um, less, you know, less, a less mediocre life. And, but in my weekend, what our attention to do, what is our attempt to do, is to look and see if we can allow you to experience consciously not only the pristine operating system, the one that you came in on, and, and the antiquated, because a lot of times we're living our lives kind of unconsciously and we don't, we're not aware of how, where we are within a system. So we make it, we stop the world again and again and again. Are you the same or different? Are you the same or different? So you can become aware of where you are, and I don't care where you are. I don't care where you are in the system, but if I can find you out in the upper operating system, in the pristine operating system, the original operating system where you're happy, full of fun, full of joy, you trust implicitly, I'll see if I can take that away from you. Ta-da, what a prick, huh? But that's the way it is. If I can take it away from you, which most times I can, just by making some sort of snide, poopy little comment uh, that you take offense at, and you go down into the antiquated system, it shows us two things, one, where you were, and what you defaulted to. Right? And then I can allow you to see how to default back into the pristine operating system where things are fun, where you can find your happiness, where you can find trust, where you can trust yourself. But I'm trying to just give you an essence of what I do, okay? so that you can see that it's different, and it's a learning method. I can't motivate you. I don't like motivate you. I can show you when the two, which operating system is running when, then you can make really viable choices on how you want to live and which operating system you want to run in. Uh, for more information, my book assists you, Noticing Fixing More Than Fixing, and uh, www.micpeakperformance.com.